team, welcome back to my channel. In this video, we're going to install SQL Server 2022. Been waiting for this for a long time. I'm going to take you through all the steps to install a developer version. Hope you like this video. So open up your favorite web browser and then point your URL to Microsoft.com ENUS SQL Server SQL Server Downloads. Scroll down until you see the developer link, then click Download Now. Select a location on your local hard disk to save this download file. Let's begin the install now. Click on Custom. I selected the default path. If you'd like to change that, change that. Then on 2, press the Install button. Let's look at the hardware and software requirements. You see the storage, 6 gigabytes minimum. Well, this install on this video, we use about 10. Memory, 4 gigabytes, processor, 2 gigahertz. That gets you in the game. In this video, we'll be installing the developer license, and I'm on Windows 10 Professional. Not sure what version OS you're using? Go to Settings, then 1, click on System. At the very bottom, with the number 2, click About. Here you can see the Windows specifications. Notice I'm using Windows 10 Pro. Let's run the System Configuration Checker to make sure everything is ready to go. Check out your results. Make sure everything passed so we can continue. Fix the errors if there are any. OK team, we're ready to install. Click on number 1, Installation, and then 2, New SQL Server Standalone. We're installing a developer license. Click 1, Developer. All done. Press 2, Next. Let's look at the license terms. Scroll down, read that. When you're done, check 3, then check 4 to continue. SQL Server just unpacking and preparing all our files for install. Here you can see another test to make sure that we have our computer ready for this install. If you have a firewall on your computer and need to open up a port, this is the document you'll want to read. Notice it's in the SQL Server 2022 Installation Configuration Windows Firewall. Make sure you understand firewalls before you start opening ports, but here's the command to do that. Let's click on Name Instance. I'm using SQL Server 2022. Now, that name must be unique on your computer. After you fill that in, let's hit 2, Next. I'm using this for a learning environment, so I don't need this feature. I turn that checkbox off, and then I press Next. Notice I'm in mixed mode. I'm going to be using SQL Server Authentication and Windows Authentication. I'm going to enter passwords, confirm that. Then on button 4, Add Current User, that puts Scott J as a uh, server admin. Then press 5, Next. Click on Add Current User to be the administrator to manage the analysis services. Setup is all done. We just need to hit that install button to begin the process. Congratulations, you did it. And there you have it, team. We just installed SQL Server 2022, a developer license. I hope you are excited about the new features and functionality of SQL Server, as I am, because we have some great learning ahead of us. I also hope that you'll want to return to this channel, you know, Software Nuggets, to watch some other videos about SQL Server 2019 and 2022, as well as other videos. Now, if you have any questions or comments about this video, please leave them below. That's all I have, team. Take care.